What is up guys, welcome back to another FIFA 14 video where we're going to be talking about one cool feature in FIFA 14 Ultimate Team and this is pure speculation by me, it is going to be about Inform. So before I begin, if you guys are looking for coins, check out UT Coin Traders, their link will be in the description. And now to begin, as you guys already know, EA have announced a shit ton of new features in FIFA 14 Ultimate Team and they are for the best. Like I said yesterday when they announced uh, single matches to be returning, today they just pretty much blew everyone's mind except the card designs of course they are shit but other than that I think everything else that they've announced is looking really really damn good now one thing that I really want to talk about is the informs like I said and there's this loyalty uh, sort of feature in FIFA 14 ultimate team where if a player that you've bought from the transfer market I think it's called well actually let's just call it the market if you buy a player from the market and you play over 10 games at your uh, and he plays over 10 games at your club basically you can apply a consumable card that actually upgrades his attributes forever so what I was thinking is how is this gonna have an effect on informs as of now informs are released every single week in FIFA 13 ultimate team and they are upgraded in a very minimal way and we barely see a difference but in FIFA 14 ultimate team I see this happening in a much better way even if they're upgraded the same way as they are in FIFA 13 ultimate team but don't forget that once you apply the stat upgrade which you could buy from the market that means they're going to be upgrade upgraded even more so this is a very cool feature that makes informs even better in my opinion not only are you going to be upgrading non inform cards but informs as well but let me just walk you through how it works this is pure speculation by me nothing is confirmed by EA that you can upgrade informs but I'm pretty sure if you can upgrade non informs you will be able to upgrade informs as well so let me just walk you through how it works if you have packed an inform you, he's already played 10 matches and you could put him straight in your club and you could apply the upgrade you don't have to play 10 matches with him because if you've packed him he's already played the 10 matches in the system but if you bought him from the market you have to play 10 matches to be able to upgrade him now imagine this you go ahead onto the market and purchase an inform you stick him into your squad and he's already just upgraded by a bit from the non-inform but then you play 10 matches with him and you upgrade an inform now imagine how good that is gonna be compared to the sort of differences you're gonna have in teams imagine the whole team is upgraded that is gonna be so fun don't you guys think let me know in the comment section below if you think my theory could be correct or this is just pure speculation by me so imagine a second inform comes out and you upgrade that now imagine the third inform comes out and you upgrade that now I want you guys to imagine a team of the year card coming out and then you upgrade that card the possibilities are near endless I'm really excited for FIFA 14 ultimate team I think it's on the right track to be pr probably the best ultimate team yet so I want you guys to imagine this much more squads are going to be more varied this time around this year in my opinion because of this sort of loyalty program I think in uh, in this uh, ultimate team and I think we're not going to be seeing the same squad every single fucking match oh and one more thing imagine the team of the year Ronaldo upgraded that's fucking insane so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did I'd really appreciate a like and also don't forget to let me know your opinions about the theory in the comment section below hope you guys enjoyed it and as usual guys I really hope you have a very nice day